Hi, I'm Matt with the U.S. Cutter Technical Support Department. Today I'm going to teach you how to use a real-life photo to create a vectorized image that can be turned into a silhouette or into an ink style based vector image. Today we're going to be using an SC series cutter, some matte black vinyl. We'll be applying it onto a corrugated piece of plastic and we're going to be using Microsoft PowerPoint and U.S. Cutter Vinyl Master software. We're going to start by opening up PowerPoint and with PowerPoint open we're going to need to first import our image. So under the insert tab we'll select picture and we'll select our image that we want to open. Uh, you may need to go in and resize the image. So we'll shrink that down a little bit. So to start we're going to come in and crop the image so we can select what we want to be displayed for our silhouette and ink drawing. So you can grab the brackets and reduce the space so we have just what we want showing. And then we'll come up here and select the remove background button. And you'll see this will clear out a lot of the background but we still have some elements of the image we need to bring in so we can again expand the borders. And that'll start bringing in elements of the design. You also have the option of using the mark areas to keep. So we can select areas that we that weren't previously selected. And we can also have mark areas to remove. We'll use this to remove this background and these pumpkins. Now, once we have the image selected, we want to go ahead and select Keep Changes. And now we have our image. Now, before we import this into our Design and Cut program, we're going to need to change the color. And it's recommended that you select the grayscale option. Once we have the image set in grayscale, we can go ahead and save the image as a JPEG by going to the File menu and selecting Save As. Under your Save As Type, you want to hit the drop down and select the JPEG File Interchange Format. And then we'll just give the file a name. For our purposes, we'll just use Cowboy. And we're going to save this out to the desktop. Uh, from here, we're going to open up Vinyl Master. We already have it open here. And we're going to need to import our image. So under the File menu, we'll select Import and File. And then we'll scroll down and find our grayscale image of the cowboy. We'll set this into the mat. And our next step is going to be to vectorize this file. So we'll select the vectorize button. Now you may need to play with the colors and some of your settings. We're going to change this to an autocorrect black and white logo. We're going to change the color down here by double clicking and selecting just a black. The trace mode we're also going to set to logo. And then we'll go ahead and select the trace option and this will go through and trace the file and vectorize the image. Once you have your file set, if you need to go back and adjust any options, you can retrace it. But when you're ready, you'll just hit accept. So now we have our image. Now we have two ways that we can go from here. We can A, cut this out in a black uh, piece of black material and this would look more like an ink based drawing. We can also create a silhouette by coming up and selecting the, selecting your image and then selecting the create cut contour. Uh, when creating your contour, you can, you'll want to change your outline option so you can get the best shape for the image possible. So we're going to expand this so we get a full outline of the shape. And then we'll hit accept. Now if you go back to your select tool, you can drag the contour cut lines away from the image. By just clicking on the contour cut line and dragging it off to the side. So here we can go in and cut the silhouette or we can cut the image itself. Once you have your two files separated, we're going to start by cutting the silhouette. So we're going to select the file and then we'll come up to cut and we'll send to cutter. 
This will bring up your cut settings window where you can rotate, uh, put a weed box around the design. We'll add that in. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and send this to cut. Now that we've cut out the silhouette, we're going to go ahead and send the uh, ink style drawing through the black and white. So we'll select the image and then we'll come up and send to cutter and we'll select cut now. To purchase the products used in today's demonstration, please visit www.uscutter.com. For step-by-step -step instructions on today's project, please visit proandhobbycutters.com.